Hello everyone, uh, my name is Preston Chase. I'm the Chief Science Officer here at uh, Optimi Health and I want to take you on a bit of a tour of some exciting developments that we have going on uh, right now at our facility here in Princeton. So we are in the final stages right now of performing our validation of the encapsulation of our MDMA as well as psilocybin. These materials will be in human hands. They will be in the hands of therapists, in the hands of patients. Supplying GMP level materials for these clinical trials is of critical importance to ensuring that the products are exactly what we say they are, the dosage strength, the materials that are in them are pure, and all of the other things like potential microbial contamination, heavy metals, everything is completely within the limits that are prescribed for human consumption. We're doing all of this production on site. This is a very exciting step for Optimi and we're excited to take you on a bit of a tour of exactly how we're going to do that today. So you'll notice that uh, we're dressed a little bit differently now. Uh, that's because we're actually in our uh, GMP area right now. Part of the process of GMP is ensuring that everything is ultra clean. Everybody behind the camera is dressed exactly the same way as I am here too. Right now we're going to show you actually in process our GMP encapsulation um, procedure that uh, is being utilized to formulate capsules that will be used for human consumption, and wow, we're excited to show it to you. So here we are in our GMP formulation room. This is where we take all of the active pharmaceutical ingredients, right now being the MDMA. The formulation process is basically we mix the API with a material called an excipient. It's basically another powder that will dilute the material so that when we fill the capsules, we're actually filling the entirety of the capsule. And when we're combining these, we need to make sure that it's very homogeneous. So as part of that, we have a two-stage process that involves uh, grinding the two materials together. This ensures that we have a relatively uniform particle size of, of, of both mixtures. And then uh, second stage, we actually have our orbital mixer here, which really ensures that that mixture is as blended uh, uniformly as what it possibly can. Once the blending process is completed, that's when we go to encapsulation. Currently right now, we are going to be filling capsules by hand. Uh, we have a, a piece of apparatus that allows us to fill 100 capsules at a time. It's done in a way that allows us to ensure that the material is evenly uh, distributed throughout all the capsules, along with the perfectly blended uh, mixture allows us to calculate the dosage exactly as, uh, as, as we want it to be. After testing and, and the other work that we need to do and, and packaging, this is the material that will be going out uh, for clinicians, for therapists, and ultimately for patients to help them heal uh, any of the issues that they have. So another critical piece of the operation here at Optimi Health is our analytical division and all of our analytical capabilities. So currently right now, we can test for the potency of the, both the MDMA and the psilocybin extracts that we have in-house. Upcoming, we are looking to expand that capability to do some additional testing. A great thing about that is that not only can we do in-house testing for our R&D work, as well as potentially going forward for the GMP material releases is we can utilize this capability for external clients. So one that will give us a source of external revenue, which will be fantastic, uh, as well as using that revenue to reinvest in more analytical capabilities for us going forward. So now that we have our GMP products, finished products, capsules in place, where are these going to go? The drug establishment license is the Health Canada stamp of approval to say that we are GMP certified and we can provide these materials to markets around the world for patients, for purchase by therapists, and also for, as I said, large clinical trials. 
So that's the uh, entirety of the encapsulation process, taking you right from the vault where we store all of our APIs, transport of the material, blending with excipients, making our uh, blend homogenous, encapsulating, and then finally doing our quality control checks to ensure that each of the capsules is perfectly weighed so that the dosage is right and the quality is uh, as high as what we can get it. Thanks very much for everybody's time today and we are uh, absolutely excited to have this process in place so that we have GMP validated process for encapsulation and for finished products that will provide material for therapists and for patients for all of the potential uses that we have for our medicines. Thank you very much.